pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for, for all. For inability to think that he's an embarrassment, to think that uh, he somehow has uh, undermine the league's credibility, their integrity, that he's somehow an embarrassment to a shield is frankly embarrassing in itself. So let me get this straight. Hit a woman, uh, be accused of sexual assault, commit sexual assault, you do all those things. United and they don't States come out and say they don't call anybody an embarrassment. I've seen far more press conferences stands, of GMs and owners nation, and coaches sticking by God, their guys amid some pretty murky and disgusting with circumstances. Liberty but that's all good. But here's somebody who's trying to stand for, for justice all. and for equality. And you consider that to be somehow embarrassing your NFL that has no problem employing some people who have done some pretty undesirable things. They'll never admit this. They'll never admit it. That's why it's always going to be anonymity. It's always going to be an unnamed GM speculating. Because I'd be embarrassed to think that way, too. Well, and I wouldn't, want no, I wouldn't want anyone else to know my name either. Exactly. And they'll always be able to hide behind the perception of his declining play. You mean to tell me they got 64 cats better than him in the NFL? Okay, the Geno Smith. Position? Colin Kaepernick, by the way, has won, what, four playoff games? Three of Three them? Three years on, removed from the Super Bowl. Three of them on the Wasn't road. Wasn't great last year, but you're not going to tell me Manuel? Really? And look, Mike Lennon is out there getting I paid. Okay? And has done nothing in this league. So you can't tell States me that, that this is about the way that and he's playing. Republic, and by the way, the team was bad. Stands, and given how bad they were and how he played, right. I think that says God, a lot. And you know what else says a lot? What his other teammates thought about. He got the highest award that can be bestowed upon a Niners player for that organization. All. So his teammates thought highly of him. The organization thought highly of him. He was not a so-called distraction. But again, Look, the good old tax says you got to be twice as good to begin with. You had better be three times as good if you're going to overcome kneeling for the national anthem. What, what's most concerning, though, is not so much Colin Kaepernick. That's not the most concerning thing because, look, the Niners haven't completely shut the door, even though they signed, to your point, Brian Hoyer, who I like, and Matt Barkley. Mm -hmm. So they haven't completely sh uh, shut the door. I think John Lynch said as much today. But the concern is that, and this is in Freeman's article on Bleacher Report, I pledge allegiance is this going to be to something that discourages of other players States of America for standing up or speaking out the for social justice for issues, even though we all knew this was possible? And he this, knew is was possible. Why, this is why Under the people God, that said he was being selfish and drawing attention to himself were always with up liberty. Well, and said he should stay in a backup quarterback place at the time yeah. were always full yeah. up. Because this was the price, this is what he was laying on the line. It's very possibility. And this is why his agent felt the need to say he's going to stand next year, knowing that somebody would use that, use his play as, a, as cover to say, you know what, we don't want any parts of that. As if answering questions about that is somehow more difficult than answering questions about somebody who's committed a domestic assault or sexual assault situation. Mm. They're full of it. But we, we know what time it is. We knew what time it was going to be a long time ago. I right. pledge here allegiance is, right in front of us. to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The civil rights picture of those years was one of violence, of segregationists lashing out in resentment at the school I pledge allegiance decision. to the flag the names in the news of the United like Rock, States of America Somewhere outside the and to the republic for which it stands, speaking, traveling, but seldom making one news nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The battle in Albany raged throughout the spring and summer of 1962. The aim was desegregation of all public facilities, the method nonviolent protest. Unexpectedly, Albany police countered with perfect order and to the flag of the United States what of America. And to the republic for which it stands, well, one nation, under God, with me now, indivisible, I've been to the mountaintop. with liberty and justice and for all. the promised land. I may not get there with you, but I want you to know tonight that we as a people will get to the promised land. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, 
one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I have a dream that one day down in Alabama, with its vicious racist, with its governor having his lips dripping with the words of interposition and other people. I pledge allegiance to the One flag day right there in Alabama, of the United States black boys of America and, black girls will be able to and to the republic for which it stands. As sisters and brothers. I have One nation today. under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands one nation under God indivisible with liberty and justice for all Under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I have a dream that
I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have you ever heard of the works of the flesh and the fruits of the spirit? Have you ever heard of the works of the flesh and the fruits of the spirit? 